Well, we are starting off with different conditions than what we had yesterday. No dense fog in the valley this morning and temperatures are definitely mild. This is what it looks like outside of the studio. There's even been some breaks in the clouds every now and then. The reason why we don't have fog, well, you can see the American flag is actually moving today. The past couple of days, it's been uh, very calm as in regards to the winds that's allowed for some fog to develop. Temperatures still mild in many locations, but they are beginning to drop. Bristolville down to 52, Hubbard at 56, Wellsville at 57. These temperatures were in the 60s around 4 or 5 o'clock this morning, so it was uh, quite warm out there there. The local radar uh, continues to show a few showers around uh, some heavier shower activity there near the Cleveland area, and I expect us to get in on some of that action uh, later on today. So uh, the regional radar here uh, showing the low pressure system moving away. The heaviest of the rain is moving out of our area, but we still are going to be stuck with some clouds and some areas of showers uh, throughout the day. So uh, temperatures there by about noon in the upper 40s, some low 40s there in Bristolville, colder air moving in, and then the chances of some showers. Then by this afternoon, a few spots will be in the upper 30s and then the low 40s, so it will be much cooler by this afternoon with the mostly cloudy skies continuing. Tonight, temperatures drop off into the upper 30s, which is where they will start tomorrow. Now, Saturday is going to be drier. There could be some sprinkles or some light rain showers. High temperatures tomorrow, though, are going to be in the low to mid 40s, so it is going to be cooler there for tomorrow. Fog tracker, I expect to have a little bit of fog once again for tomorrow morning. It certainly won't be as widespread as it has been over the the past few days, but expect to deal with some of that tomorrow morning. Temperatures will continue to drop off throughout the day here. They'll be in the upper 30s by the end of the day with those uh, chances for showers continuing. Now, as far as the day on Saturday, Saturday stays dry, but uh, late Saturday night into Sunday, rain will but once again push into the valley there, and that's going to last throughout the day. Sunday still could see some areas of uh, some mixture of uh, snow and then maybe changing over to light snow as we head into Sunday afternoon and Sunday evening. Significant snowfall accumulations not expected from the storm system, though, and then there could be some residual snow showers by Monday morning. As far as the future rainfall model goes, we are going to get quite a bit more rain again. The end of January here has been quite wet with all of the rain that we've had this week. Anywhere from three quarters of an inch to maybe even over an inch of rain expected from this storm system. So get ready for some of those uh, more muddy conditions. Seven-day outlook, mostly cloudy Saturday, 42. Rain comes in late Saturday, lasts into Sunday. That could change over to some snow on Sunday, which will continue into early Monday. And then throughout the rest of the week, next week, temperatures will be in the upper 30s and low 40s.